Gatorade and Powerade both contain electrolytes, but Powerade is advertised to contain 50% more electrolytes. We're gonna use some chemistry to put this claim to the test. Let's first use an audio conductivity meter to see if these two drinks conduct electricity. Yep, both drinks conduct electricity, all right. So both drinks contain electrolytes. Hey, let's see if these drinks contain enough electrolytes to light up this conductivity tester. That's a no for Gatorade. Huh, that's a no for Powerade too. Hey, let me try one more test. I know that the conductivity of solutions increases with temperature. So let's warm these bottles and try the test again. All right, these drinks have been warming for a while and now it's time to test them with the conductivity tester that lights up. Well, that's a negative for the warm Gatorade. Whoa, but the warm Powerade lights up and that's consistent with it having more electrolytes.